We are gonna have high winds. We're gonna have rain on the way. And from my experience, this is gonna go one of two ways. First, we're not gonna see a thing. We're maybe gonna get a bird. Or second, it could be the best day we've had so far. There's only one way to find out what kind of day it's gonna be. We're gonna head out into the North Main Woods and see what kind of grass hunting we get into. Cold this morning. Is it gonna be one of those mornings we don't see any because it's windy and cold, or are we gonna see a bunch? We're gonna see plenty of birds, but they're not gonna stand there. Look at you this time. Oh, jeez. Two of them. Just right in front of the truck. Way down. Yeah. To start, nice brown face. Little fat bird. <laughs> hey. Man, that was a tough one. Red face. Nice one too, huh? Beauty. Big bird. Nice bird. Look at that. That's all I needed. A couple birds. All right, we're gonna we're gonna head out for a little walk right now while the weather's still nice. With grouse, you know, you can be pretty loud. Kind of stumble through this stuff every now and then, and that's not necessarily gonna make them flush, at least in this area. But what it's gonna accomplish for me is it's gonna make them take a couple steps. If they start getting nervous and unsure of themselves, they'll walk. As you can hear, when you take a couple little steps in this area, you can really hear it. That's pretty much just what I do. I just walk slow. Every now and then I make a little noise with my feet. And then lastly, every now and then I just stop. When I do stop, I am usually quiet. And you just listen. So if you ended up stopping anywhere near one, when you sit there and hang out like that, they start to get nervous and they'll move their heads around, which allows me to see them. And they'll also start to either flush or take a couple steps so i just kind of wanted to let you know how i approach walking but anyway hopefully we're going to see a couple see it is it close enough Boy. you ain't going anywhere drum. i don't know why they drum in the fall like that i know they do but they don't really have a reason unless it's territory Oh, as I was talking, I started thinking, well, if he's drumming, he's got to be two of them, right? The one. I think so. I think I hit that other one. Find out here in a second. Yeah. Hey, that was a good stop. Drumming like that, there's usually a whole flock or two around. As soon as I walked in, I was thinking that. If he's sitting there perched up like that, there's more birds around. That marks my limit. That is four birds. Definitely means that we're gonna get to do a catch and cook today. Of course, dad's gonna be, he still has a limit of four, so we can still get some grouse. But as the weather starts turning like this, you know, the morning was good because they were coming out to get some feed. But when the rain starts coming down, mixed in with this, almost a snow, just a hail, a freezing rain. Grouse don't like that, so they're gonna go roost. We may get lucky, you never really know. Anyway, there's only one way to find out. Did you find any good spots for him? Well, I was interested in going back to this road. That's the one we didn't do yet. I don't know how the road would be. It's hard to tell. We can go look. If it's no good. We can go somewhere else.
Yeah, that was a good wing shot. I didn't catch that on film, but. Nice. Good shot. Find him? I thought I had him. I took my eye off. Did you see him hit the ground? Yeah, I shot him a second time. Back out. Get right under here. I knew what got it. The second time. <laughs> Houdini. Now, once that rain started, the grouse really started to taper off a half hour in when we weren't seeing a thing. So we just decided to pack it up. You know, we got five grouse and that's more than enough to do something that I haven't done in a while. The rain really made me think about comfort meals and one of my personal favorites is a grouse pot pie. And that's what we're gonna be making today. I believe that a comfort meal needs to be a couple things. It needs to be warm and it needs to be easy to make. And that's exactly what this meal is. So all these vegetables are gonna be straight from a can and that's gonna make things way simpler. All you have to do is add everything into a big pot, heat it up, get your dough laid out, and then pour that into the pot pie and stick that in the oven. So it's really not that complicated to make and let's jump right in. I encourage you guys to go try that meal for yourself. And if you guys wanna help support the channel, you can go to my website, link down below, and check out some of the merchandise that I've got lifts up there. If you guys enjoyed this video and you wanna see more like it, you can click that playlist right there. It is a whole collection of all the grouse videos I've ever done. So have a good night, guys.